Hello YouTube world, this is Alex the Gaming Teacher, and welcome back to the walkthrough of Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. As you're watching this video, feel free to give it a like and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. So last episode we made our way through the Castle of Oblivion, and we're here pretty much towards the end. Uh, we have Marluxia, I always like to pronounce Marluxia, but anyways, that's uh, pretty much the last enemy we have to take care of. So we have this room here, I'm pretty sure this is the one that's going to lead to the enemy. Before that though, let's just get to the deck again. I have to make a one last edit here. So I got zero cards. And I'm realizing is this slate here. I wonder should I just toss that and then put a couple more fires. But... I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like... I feel like it's probably best that we do. Because you know, Mario Fields just pull out a zero card. I do know that Marlo should, like, moves a lot, so... I'm just gonna get rid of that. Throw in... Okay, this way you could have three Firagas, and then three more after you use the Mega uh, Ether, but yeah, just gotta see how it goes first. And yeah, there's no room for anything else unless I get rid of a card, and I don't feel like getting rid of anything. Okay, so I wasn't sure. Yeah, so the last time I think this was going to be the room, but I'm pretty sure this might be just another room as well. Oh my gosh, I could have done Calm Bounty. Uh, yeah, maybe what the heck, I should just do a Moogle room then. I mean, we're towards the end, so it doesn't really matter. So yeah, you can see that doorway has already been... There's already a doorway open there, so... So I got Super Glide as well, so... I was waiting. I do have another Key to Rewards card, but... I'm not gonna backtrack. Alright, well, we're just gonna see what the heck. Oh, shit, I got another nine. Well, pfft. I don't even think I have enough to buy anything, do I? Yeah. I am not gonna really. Well, a 251. I mean, what the hell then? Excuse my language. I meant, what the heck? Oh gosh, look at all those genies. I'm like, I haven't used genie in a while. But that was a waste. You did get a 9 though, so I'm most certainly gonna, since it's an Olympia. Yeah. Alright, that should definitely do. Alright, so we'll slap that in. Like over here, perhaps, and then pumpkin head or lady luck. It's gotta be lady luck. Yeah. All right. So that's six nine cards actually. That's pre that's pretty good. So six nine, six eights. Alrighty then. Got full health. And here we go. You've defeated Axel. <laughs> the Keyblade's power. How I've longed to make it my own. Let Nominate go! You've no chance of winning. Nominate, erase Sora's memory. <laughs> 
bread. But if I do that... That's right. Sora's heart will be destroyed. His heart destroyed? You can do that! I'd rather have preferred him unmarred. But he can be rebuilt, more to my liking, with time. Namine, do it. No. Sora forgave me even... when I deceived him. So how could I destroy his heart? There's no way! I don't care what happens to me. I won't hurt Sora. I won't do it! Then you will. Do it, Namine! <sighs> I don't care. You can erase my memory. Sora! Why'd you say that? Because... Who will I look after if I don't have... Namine? So just do it. Erase my memories. Destroy my heart. I promised. I'll always protect you. You have to believe me. Sora. I don't need any memories to take on someone like Marluxia. You bet. Even if Sora forgets it all, you can I won't forget. Donald's right. He and I can remember everything for Sora. See? I'll have all my friends' memories, so I can piece my own together again. You ignorant fool. If Namine uses her powers to erase your memory, you'll be nothing but an empty shell. Your heart will no longer be able to feel or to care, just like Vexen's pathetic imitation of your Riku. Take another guess. <laughs> what? Ah! It can't be. Riku! No. Just an imitation. Uh, you're a shell. A shell who has had everything taken. Everything! What can you possibly think I ever had? Both my body and my heart are fake. But there is one memory I'll keep, even if it's just a lie. Whether it was a phantom promise or not, I will. Protect Nominee! Imbeciles. You would knowingly shackle your heart with a chain of memories born of lies? You would be one who has a heart, yet cast aside your heart's freedom? You turn from the truth because your heart is weak. You will never defeat me! Fire! 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 Ah! 
is actually different from the version on the Game Boy. Um, so, let's see, there's still need a scene first. Oh, that's right, the level gains. Um, I do have the opportunity to increase my card stock. And the thing is, when you take on him the second or third time, it's going to be back to back, so I'm going to have to keep my zero cards in. Uh, I'm wondering what should I do. I don't know. I'm just gonna. I'll just go with HP. So you have the opportunity to save first. As you could say that. <laughs> However, what you destroyed was merely an illusion of me. So what? <laughs> Another imitation. He's really in there? Yes. I knew it. I can feel his power. It's trying to destroy my heart. Gorge! We'll just take care of him together! Sure! Come on! Riku, protect Namine. You don't mind? <laughs> Should I? All right. Oh, interesting. I thought they'll all be facing the door. Alright, well. Certainly just gonna save, so. Yeah, we're gonna have to fight him two more times. So, like I said, in the Game Boy Advance version, uh. We would only fight him one more time. Uh, the battle's gonna basically be like he's gonna be on, like, some kind of. Some kind of ship thing. Or machinery. Uh, but he won't be using slates, but he will use slates in the third one, and. Honestly, it's going to be super hard to, like, you know, use your cards in that last battle. I'm still going to keep them just in case I can still. Uh, so, you know, the deck's just going to stay as it is. The IR thing was pretty effective there. And you notice I was just using fire, fire, fire. I didn't really do Faraka much. But, i got to remember, I used that Mega either too soon. Because I could still do Kiraga. I think I'll one, two, three. And then one, two, three. Yeah, so you can do three Kiragas. Gotta always keep that in mind. And Vex, and I'll just keep this the wall. And, uh. Yeah, it's actually not a bad thing to have the zero cards in this next fight, anyways, because zero cards does break anything. And yeah, 
We'll just see how it is. Really, it's second to last. Yeah, I'm not quite sure why, but I'm thinking maybe because... I don't know. They decided to just want to have a third battle. Soon the emptiness will shatter your heart. Here in this world of nothingness. As lightless oblivion devours you, drown in the ever-blooming darkness! Blooming? Specialties with the flowers? Alright, so the idea here is you have to destroy those two claws first. Your heart shall be judged! Away. Okay. The idea here is you do not want to really use slice all of them. Dang it. What was. Nah. I'm thinking I might skip Cloud until I destroy those. Fire! What the? Fire. Oh, that's right. No good. Courage. Ha. No good. Ha. Fire. Oh, I thought. Oh, to you can actually. Uh... Your heart power. Ha. Nah, I don't know if I would do oh, Scooby right. either. Courage. Ha. Heal. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, you get your checkpoint as well. Sink into the darkness. Oh boy. What? Power. Yeah, I don't even know what that is because that thing's got a face. Power. Yeah, I think it's better to just Heart will be scattered. What? Yeah, do you want to Oh boy. No what? No good. No good. Your heart shall be judged. Power. Away. Fire. 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 Your heart shall be judged. Heal. Heal. You'll now know real fear. Behold! Oh boy. This is gonna be... Guilty! Yeah, it's always gonna stay in the air though, so... Keeps moving as well. Oh. 
seems like still in a way. Oh goodness. Oh boy, that was a waste. Where did he go? Ugh, seriously. Okay, well. Cloud's probably not gonna be effective here. Fire! Fire! Sink into the darkness! Heal! 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 Oh my gosh. No good! Heal! Behold! What? No good. Final. Ah. Ugh. So. Oh, I wonder if we missed that time. Heal. Do you want to? No good. What? Oh, shoot. Power. Deal. Hmm. What is that? Prepare. Sink and what? Yeah. Behold. Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, no, I'll do it with that. Behold. Fire. Oh, dang, that was not good. Behold. Donald. Ah, okay. Courage. I'm gonna set up all these Heal. here, anyways. Heal. That's fine. What? Oh wait, what? Yeah. Oh, Why wasn't super gliding? What? Do you want to scream? Ah, jeez. Wasn't trying to take these things, but... Alright, there we go. Oh, <laughs> ah, there's your card. So yeah, long battle, but he doesn't have any zero cards, so it shouldn't be a problem. But this last one, though, can be. Your hopes are doomed to the darkness. That can be pretty hectic, because you're gonna see in a bit one attack he has is that all your cards are gonna drop, and you have to pick them up. And unfortunately, they're gonna be in a random order. I don't know. So we have to do quickly is it's a really crazy fight this one here. Do you want to Oh shoot, there we go. It's already happened. Fudge. Your heart will be scattered. What? 
Oh no. Do you want to scream? Oh wait a second. Does it go back in order? Oh. Maybe I was wrong then. Goodness gracious. Yeah, I'm like. Heal! Away! Yeah! Your heart shall be judged! No boy. Lose everything! Ah, dang it. Happen again. Your heart will be stabbed! Too soon. Slate ready to go, so. Will be um. Power. Uh. The beginning of the end. Huh. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Behold. Oh shoot, this... That one I'm just not even playing around with. Fire! Heal! Away! Alright, let's end this. Yes, this! This is the heart of a hero! Yeah, so fortunately, don't take a lot of damage, but yeah. It's actually not a bad thing then. I thought the cards would be scattered all over the place. Locking a keyhole. You okay, Riku? Not Riku. I'm a fake. I can't remember why I was created or where or when. All that's inside of me is time with you and Namine. But I know, those memories are not real. Gee, Namine, can't you use your magic to put Riku's memory back to normal? Well, I... It's all right. I'll deal. Wait! Who cares if someone created you? You are you and nobody else. You have your own heart inside you. Those feelings and memories are yours, and yours alone. They're special. Sora, you're a good guy. I don't have to be real to see how real your feelings are. That's good enough. 
Riku! Riku. Can you put our memories back? Yes. Not remembering something doesn't really mean that it's gone. What do you mean? When you remember one thing, that leads to remembering another. And then another, and then another. Our memories are connected. Many pieces are linked together, like they're in a chain that makes up each of us. I don't actually erase any memories. Just take apart the links and rearrange them. You still have all your memories. So you can put them back together? Yes, but first, I have to undo the chains of the memories I made on my own. After I've done that, I have to gather up the memories scattered across each of your hearts, and then reconnect them. It might take some time, but I think it might work. No, it will work, I'm sure. It's my turn to look after you. All right. We all really trust you. Oh, wait a second. You said you'd have to undo the links of the memories you made. But that means... Yes. You won't be able to remember anything... about what happened here. Not even you? I'm sorry. It's the only way, I'm afraid. Sora. You have a choice. You can lose your memories of this castle and reclaim your old ones, or keep your memories here and give up the memories that you've lost. Do I have to... to choose? Yes. Make me like I was. Oh. Okay. Nobody needs to keep a bunch of memories that aren't real, right? You want to remember all of the people who are really important to you. Anybody would choose that. It's a tough decision to make, but of course, I would do the same thing. To remember again, we have to sleep in that? Yes. It's going to take a little time, but I'll take care of you. Gorsh, when we wake up, we won't remember who you are anymore. But how are we going to thank you? Don't worry about that. I'll just make a big note in my journal. And it will say, thank nominate. Oh, good. That makes me feel better. Well, good night then, nominee. Good night, Goofy. You too, Sora. Okay. All of this may have started with a lie, but I really am glad that I can meet you, Sora. Yeah, me too. When I finally found you, and even when I remembered your name, I was happy. The way I felt then, that was no lie. Goodbye. No, not goodbye. When I wake up, I'll find you. And then there will be no lies. We're gonna be friends for real. Promise me, Naminé. You're going to forget making that promise. 
if the chain of memories comes apart, the links will still be there, right? So the memory of our promise will always be inside me somewhere. I'm sure of it. Yeah, you're right. Okay, it's a promise. Good. Until later. memories links are deep in the shadows of your heart and I won't be able to find them but don't worry you made another promise to someone who you could never replace she is your light the light within the darkness remember her and all the memories lost in the shadows of your heart will come into the light another promise Look at the good luck charm. I changed its shape when I changed your memory. But when you thought of her just once, it went back to the way it was. Kyrie! My friends. Namine? Don't worry. You might forget about me. But with our promise, I can come back. A promise is a promise. Yes. One day the light. It will be ours, and it will bring us together. Till then, I'll be in your heart. Right. Forgotten, but not lost. Okay, so that is a wrap for... Uh, so there's actually two modes in this game. I'm very sure you guys are aware of this though, but we played as Sora, but there's actually another version where we play as Riku, and the uh, events are happening simultaneously. So basically what happens is that Riku is also somewhere in the castle, but he's like in the basement area. It's kind of bizarre, but basically he's starting from the bottom, he's working himself up to the top to get to the ground level. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be actually another series, but I'm not going to do that right away. Uh, I'm just going to give this a little break. Uh, it is much shorter though, I know that for sure, because basically you're going to take on uh, all the same Disney bosses, but there's really no cutscenes. The only cutscenes you really see are in between the worlds, and there's actually one Disney World though, there is some dialogue. Uh, I think it's the very first one, the Hall of Bastion. But otherwise, yeah, it's pretty quick, so it wouldn't take me that long, but I, it won't be long. I'm just going to give a little break. I'm going to be working on other uh, series, such as, you probably already saw that I've began Uncharted 3, because I've been eager to get that done, because it's, again, part of this bundle that I got for free um, you know, on PlayStation Store. I want to make sure I get through it though before I upgrade the storage system to two terabytes. Uh, so I don't want anything bad to happen. 
even though I do have an own copy, but this one was free. I know that it's from the store, so there should never be any issues. And the nice thing, of course, is that I don't have to worry about putting the CD in in order to play it. I kind of wish that all games were like that for the PS4. It's like you download it, but then you still have to have, to have the disc inside the system. But anyways, yeah, so I'm doing that. I'm also going to be doing a Family Guy for the PS2. Uh, but anyways, back to this though. You know, I love this game. So and as far as ranked wise, you know, I always think about Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and 3 are at the top. And I probably would say this might be right after that though. Because, you know, you're dealing with cards, but it's a big thing with numbers. I'm a big numbers guy. Uh, so it's always nice to have something like that. Um, you know, battle music, of course, is pretty good. And the storyline is kind of intriguing. You're thinking like, okay, there's all these multiple bosses here. Uh, one group here is just planning to take over the organization. And then there's others that are like, you know, just, you know, working on both sides. Not really both sides, I'd say, but they're not as who they appear, at least to the other organization members. And it's just very interesting. Uh, now, of course, the original was on the Game Boy Advance. Uh, I would honestly say that the Game Boy Advance version is way tougher just because it feels like you're a limited amount of space here. Uh, it's like you can actually avoid some of the attacks even if you're not trying to break the slates or, you know, whatever it is. Whereas in the Game Boy Advance, it's almost impossible to do that. In order to avoid the attacks, you basically have to break uh, their card. So, but that's the Game Boy Advance version. I'm talking about this one here. The open space kind of feels nice. And obviously, because it's PS2, I mean, of course, it's originally PS2, so PS2 versus Game Boy Advance, you know, obviously I like games with the better graphics. Uh, but, you know, the gameplay is pretty cool, though. Um, you know, it soars on its own, basically. You can choose to use Donald Goofy if you want to. Uh, you know, the level designs is pretty nice. So, you know, yeah, I give it an A. It's definitely a game worth playing again and again. Now, there is something else here uh, with Jiminy's Journal. I'm not sure. I don't think there's, like, any extra scenes on, like, Kingdom Hearts 1 if you complete the journal. Uh, one thing I know is it would probably be a brutal thing to do because, like, basically completing the journal, I believe, is, like, uh, getting all the cards that exist in the game because, of course, characters, there's nothing to worry about that because you're always going to be seeing them. Uh, but as far as cards go, Jeopardy's Journal, I probably will just do that on the side. And if I ever do accomplish it, then I'll just put a little short recording showing you guys here is what it looks like. Okay, so the song just ended, so... Should be... Okay, what is this? So these are the organization members, and you can see there's some seats that are empty. Those are basically the enemies that were just killed. Uh, you know... Lark scene, Marluxia... What is this? There's always sleep between part and meet with our usual words on the usual street. I don't even know, I wasn't really reading it that well. So let us part like we always do, and in a world without you, I'll dream of you. It was like poetry. When I come when I come to, let us meet with our usual words on the usual street. Okay, I am really I have no idea what that was just saying there. But alright, so here we go, battle record. They don't usually show this, I think, on standard mode, but it just kind of tells you overall what you did. So, 80% of the journal is covered, so not too much left to do. Actually, I think Riku mode has part of it to do with it as well. So it's really just those enemy cards. Uh, car collector rank. I have no idea what that is. Enemies defeated. Look, I only got one special treasure, of course. Car breaks. Of course, Omni Slash, my favorite slate. That's why I was most often used most often. It even tells you how long it took you to beat the game, so... 16 hours, that sounds just about right. I th think we just have like 17 or 18 episodes, I'm not sure. To look at that. 
But yeah, it's kind of nice to see um, what the battle report is. So now, if you want to get the Rico mode started, then say you have to save the file. Because I think if you just set end game, I'm not sure if that's anything different. But I just always go with save. Make sure we save this to assure. Now, of course, just like with the first game, if I load this file again, it'll actually take me back to right before the s final two battles with Marluxia. So you could defeat him all over again if you want to. But now, as you go back to the start menu, this is what it will look like. So they call it reverse or birth. Again, don't know what that means, but anyways. Thank you guys all for watching the series. If you enjoyed it, just please smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, and put any comments down. So it's been real fun. Uh, again, I mentioned the things I'm going to be working on, but other than that, thank you guys again, and I'll see you guys real soon.